Hello programmers, welcome back to my tutorial. First of all, this tutorial is made in Swift 4 on Xcode 9, but if you are still using Swift 3, then this should work fine for you. Today I will show you how to use Pickup View. Pickup View is similar to drop down menu. So let's get started. Here I have already created a new project. What we will do is we will display selected country name on label, that too without using a button. So let's quickly add label and picker view to uh, picker view on our view. So let's search for picker view. And this is what we want. And we also want a label. So I will drag and drop a label here. I will put it over here. Let's give some constraints. It will be zero from top, zero from left and zero from right. And the fixed height, add four constraints. And for the label, it will be like let's put it here in between so align horizontally in container and we will give it 8 from top and width and height fixed so width will be 250 and height will be let's say 100 and add constraints let's center it and increase the size as well so I guess we are done with the uh, storyboard part. So let's just connect our picker view. So it will be picker view and label will be say country label and hit connect. So I'll just make this initially say select country hit enter and we are done with the storyboard part so let's hop over to our view controller so the way i did that was like from this to straight view control it's uh, shortcut is command enter so you hop over to standard editor so let's get rid of this and we need to get two protocols which is just type in picker and you will get ui picker view data source and picker view delegate so try to build the application you will get two errors so select select it and hit fix so you will get uh, one function and this one is number of components i did not get another function i guess this this method is not working but it's an xcode 9 thing so let's go to uh, just hit command and go to data source jump to definition and these two methods are compulsory so let's just copy them copy go back and under view did load hit enter and just paste them so get rid of all this and we need brackets so brackets and get rid of all this brackets and we also need one more method which is title for row picker view and we need one more method which is did did select row for picker view okay so number of components will be returned one and now let's create an array of countries so countries will be i'll start with india let's say turkey germany austria and one more will be let's say um, anything it can be brazil okay so we have our countries array so under number of rows in component just return return countries dot count and title for row will be return countries and brackets just pass in row so this row comes from here and for did select row will be country label dot text equal to countries and just pass in row again so let's run our application and see how it works. So our application is running. So here it is. Uh, we don't see any 
contained in our picker loop or we just see the lines so we forgot something so under view did load just say picker view dot delegate is equal to self and picker view dot data source is equal to self and this picker view is this is our uh, picker view is our outlet okay and run the application again so this time it should probably work so let's select uh, Brazil we get Brazil Austria and we are doing this without any pressing of button or anything so it's working really good so uh, doing it like selecting the country and pressing a button it's like two 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 way process okay so this is much more intuitive than doing that so how this work is this method which is did select row is it's a delegate method of picker view which falls under uh, ui picker view delegate protocol so thank you guys keep watching and don't forget to subscribe for further videos videos